Well, in business news, the Tinkan Alan Command of the Nigerian Customs Service anticipates collecting a revenue target of 1.130 trillion naira in 2024, as revealed by the controller Dera Nadi. The area controller shared this information while highlighting the command's activities in 2023. TVC News correspondent Ifunaya Eze reports. Also, controller Dera Nadi presented the command's call card, disclosing that 716 billion naira was remitted to the government coffers in 2023, falling short of the 801.1 billion naira revenue target. He announced a higher task for 2024, aiming to generate 1.130 trillion naira. Tinkan Island Port Command, starting from this January, is expected to collect 94 billion, 230 million, 670 thousand, 990 naira 11 cobalt every month. That also translates to 21 billion, 666 million, 223,216 naira 12 cobalt every week. That means on daily basis, officers and men of Tinkan Island Port Command, with the support of our stakeholders, importers and freight forwarders, and you, the media, are supposed to collect 4,332,444,643 naira every day. Expressing optimism about achieving the revenue mandate, Comptroller Dera Nadi mentioned deploying ICT for efficient service delivery. He highlighted strategic modalities to promote compliant trading. We have declared in Tinkan that 2024 is the year of stakeholders. We believe that they are going to reciprocate this kind gesture from us that we have done in order to offer them service delivery by paying appropriate duty, making correct declarations, and being generally compliant. The CGC has also, upon resumption as the CG, launched the AEO program, Authorized Economic Operators uh, Program, all to reward compliance of um, traders who do it right. Emphasizing the vital role of exports in the economy's survival, he assured stakeholders of prioritized engagement and regular sensitization exercises for trade facilitation. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.